following special program, Amazing Discoveries, is a paid advertisement for Alphanetics, presented in its entirety by Media Arts International. Coming up next on Amazing Discoveries, we'll show you how to read 5, 10, even 20 times faster and increase your comprehension with a powerful new speed reading system called Alphanetics. You'll also meet in person the man listed in the Guinness Book of World Records as the fastest talker in the world. And for the first time on Amazing Discoveries, we're going to attempt to set a new world's record as we test our nominee as the fastest reader in the world. Now, here's the host of Amazing Discoveries, Mike Levy! Welcome! Welcome! We've got a great show for you today! Now, today's show is all about reading. Now, I'm sure most everyone out there knows how to read, but what if you could pick up a good book and read it cover to cover in just a matter of hours? Or you could pick up a newspaper and read the whole newspaper, not just the headlines, but the whole thing in just a matter of minutes. Wouldn't that be good? Wow. Here's a book for you to read while you watch the show. <laughs> well, on today's Amazing Discoveries, you're going to meet Owen Skousen. Now, Mr. Skousen is an educator, an author, and the creator of a powerful new speed reading system called Alphanetics. And he says his system can unleash a power within you that will allow you to literally read at lightning fast speeds and remember what you've read. Now, wouldn't that be nice? Yeah. And you're going to meet a guy that we found that may just be the world's fastest reader. And we'll see because we're going to test him on today's show. And I'll tell you, you'll be amazed at what he can do. Building a better and brighter future through reading with Alphanetics. That's our focus on this edition of Amazing Discoveries. <laughs> now, Owen Skousen. You've made your entire career out of helping people get the most out of themselves. You're an educator, an author, you've been with the Red Sox organization, and you're the creator of the Alphanetic Speed Reading Program. Now, I, I always thought that speed reading takes a, a special kind of person to catch on to it, doesn't it? Oh, oh no, Mike. Anyone can use the program and benefit from it. The Alphanetic Program is designed to be used by anyone. Anyone can benefit by it. Well, now I've seen people speed read, they're flipping through the pages and they're running their fingers down. But do you really remember what you've read? I can understand that it doesn't matter if you're reading fast or slow. If you don't understand what you're reading, it doesn't really matter. The system was designed to help people read not only faster, but with much better comprehension than they've ever had. So Alphanetics allows you to read faster and it actually makes you have better comprehension? That's right, Mike. And anyone can do this, right? Anyone can do it. Well, Owen, I don't know whether you've seen Amazing Discoveries before, but we're famous for our Amazing Discoveries challenges. And we got a great challenge okay. for you and Alphanetics on today's show. Good. Now, our challenge takes place over in our Amazing Discoveries classroom. And our students are members of the audience from all walks of life. And, of course, a classroom wouldn't be the same without a teacher. Meet Judy Worthen. Judy, what are you going to do? Hi, Mike. It's really great to be here. Today, I'm going to teach the Alphanetics program to these students. Okay, and also join us is Mr. Dale Hall. Now, Mr. Hall is the guy that high school and college students fear the most. You see, he's the guy that administers the SAT tests. And Mr. Hall, what are you going to do? Mike, I'm passing this essay out to these people so that I can test them on their reading speed and their comprehension level. Now, you pay attention, Mike, because after I've taught the <laughs> Alphanetics program to these students, you're really going to be surprised at the results. <laughs> She's quite a teacher. All right, I'll tell you what we're going to do, Judy. We're going to have Mr. Hall retest everyone in the classroom, and Owen, we'll see whether Alphanetics has improved their reading and comprehension scores. Now, that's what I call an amazing discoveries challenge. Now, Owen, you've got to show us how this alphanetic stuff works. I mean, how can you say that someone can, can quickly read lightning speed and then remember what they've read? I mean, how does this work? Mike, come on over and let me show you how it works. I'm ready. Mike, remember when you were young and you were taught how to read out loud? Yeah, you sat around in a reading circle and you read those books with Dick and Jane and Spot. I'll tell you what would be a truly an amazing discovery if we could find Dick and Jane. Whatever happened to them? Where are they now? <laughs> well, Mike, reading this way... Reading out loud, we could only read one word at a time. We could only speak one word at a time. Right, makes sense. Now, we eventually learn how to read without saying the word out loud. Right. But we still said the word in our mind. I know, you're taught to sound it out in your mind. Right. right. Now, my alphabetic program, Mike, shows you the secret of being able to read without even sounding it in your mind. Right. And when you put your mind to work, your ability to read is unlimited. I see. So that's how it works. So you, and you're in a, that's why you get so much right. speed. Now, let me show you what I mean, Mike. Okay. We're going to put a picture on the monitor. And Amazing I want you discoveries. To, uh, I'm good so far. <laughs> okay. You, 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 <laughs> now, I'm going to put it on the monitor. I want you to look at it for three seconds. Three seconds. And then okay. I want you to I'm tell ready. me what you saw. I'm ready. Good. Okay, Let's go. go. That's a bunch of junk. Looks like my, my closet. <laughs> what a mess. <laughs> what is this? 
Okay. Now, Mike, tell me what you saw there. Uh, I think I saw some sort of a, a red tank over here, a fire uh -huh. extinguisher, something uh -huh. like that. And in the middle here, I, there was like a typewriter. Where uh -huh. our, it was a laptop computer with a screen with somebody stuck a nose on the front of it or something. <laughs> and uh, trying to pull my leg here. And probably, I think there were a couple of bananas up here, something with a, a white, okay. maybe a golf now, ball. Now, Mike, that's, that's great. You saw that whole screen side to side. From, from, hey, from top to bottom. Pretty good. I did pretty good sides. with this. That's, that's great, Mike. I'm great at this. All right. Now, now let's take another little test here. Okay, I'm ready. We're going to put another picture on. I'm you ready? I'm ready so far. Go for it. Okay, ready? Go. Wait a minute. That's a bunch of words. I can't... I, uh, Mike, Owen. Wait, how would you read, Mike? What did you read? Uh, not very much in three seconds there, Owen. It said something like, everyone reads or something like that. Everyone knows. Okay, is that all you read? Is that all you saw? I remember seeing, I think I remember seeing someplace amazing discoveries in Okay, there. Mike, that's my whole point. You started reading where you normally read, one word at a time at the top. Right. But your eyes saw the whole page because you saw amazing discoveries down here. Oh, yeah, you it's all the way down the here. You saw the whole page. I see. And, Mike, the that. alphabetics program teaches you to recognize words by groups. Recognize the meanings immediately. And that's how it works. So that's why it's so powerful. We decided to visit some high school students who have really caught on to alphanetics. We took our film crew and we visited a high school in Tempe, Arizona. Take a look at this footage. Frank Marizio, you teach high school psychology and history. Now, a student has to master a great many skills, especially to go on to college. How does reading rank among all these skills? Well, Mike, reading definitely ranks number one. It is the top priority. It's the skill that is most essential to attaining the other skills in the academic areas. Unfortunately, Mike, many of our students don't like to read. They feel it's a chore instead of something they want to do. Now, you've had a chance to take Owen's system, and you, you've given it to several of your students in, the, in a class, right? Have you seen a difference in their performance? Oh, like night and day, like a light went off in their head. First, they begin reading better, and once they read better, they wish to read more. Face it, if you do something better, you want to do it more. For the first time, Mike, I noticed students reading for recreation because they want to instead of because they have to. But that's got to be an improvement. Well, give me an example. Tell me a story about a student. Jimmy Muro was a typical high school student. Did not enjoy reading at all. His pretest was a below average 190 words per minute. Right. After Owen's system, he tested at 2,500 words a minute. Just amazing. Now, Rob here is the fastest reader in the class. All right, Rob, here's a book. I'm opening up to a chapter. Start reading. Oh, come on. You're actually reading that fast? Come yeah. on. I can go a lot faster, but you're kind of making me nervous. I'm making you nervous? Well, wait. How fast is that? How fast are you reading right now? I finished the program off reading 3,950 words a minute. Wow, that's fast. At first, I was very hesitant with taking the reading program. I didn't want to read. I didn't like to read. As I went through the program, I learned to read more faster, more quickly, and I learned to enjoy it more. Now I can pick up a book and read it faster than I have been able to, and I never thought that I'd be able to read as fast as I am now. When I first started out, I was a below average reader. Now I'm reading about 2,000 words a minute, but better than that, I went from a C to an A in English. Not bad, huh? Now, Chad and Josh here have just finished a little friendly competition to find out who was the fastest reader. What was your ending uh, total? 3,840 words per minute. Whoa, and yours? 3,600 words per minute. Look at that. Both of them over 3,000 words a minute. I mean, that's really something. Mike, if you'll take the program, you can read that fast, too. Really? Yeah, and anybody can learn the program. Really? Crazy. I'll try it. And I am going to try it, too. You know, we heard a lot of numbers being thrown around. Reading speeds, 1,000 words a minute, 2,000 words a minute. To understand what all that meant, I went out and got a copy of the Guinness Book of World Records. And I looked up to see how fast the fastest reader reads in the whole world. And he reads very fast. And we were going to invite him to come on our show today. But our research staff found someone that they say reads even faster. Welcome to Amazing Discoveries, Fred Hirsch. Fred, what do you do? I work for a Phoenix law firm. Phoenix law firm, and you're a pretty fast reader? I get by. Okay. <laughs> and we're going to test you on today's Amazing Discoveries, and if you beat the world's record today on Amazing Discoveries, you will see a world's record set that we're going to submit to the Guinness Book of World Records. And to make things even more fun during this test, we've also invited someone else in the Guinness Book of World Records, John Mashita. Now, John is the fastest talker in the world. Welcome to Amazing Discoveries, John. Hi, Mike. It's really a puzzle to be here. You know, I've been looking forward to being here. Now that I'm here, I'm really happy that I'm here. I know things are going to go great, and I'm looking forward to doing this whole contest. Okay, okay. <laughs> and to give 
them both something to read. We chose a book, a big book, War and Peace, almost 1,200 pages long, and we're going to have them start from book two. Open up your books, open up, and we're going to let them read for 15 seconds, and then we're going to calculate their words per minute. You ready? On your mark, get set. Go! In October of 1805, the Russian troops were occupying the towns and villages of the Austrian and Austrian first regiments kept arriving for Russian encampment in the fortress of Bernau. Bernau and the head of the one whom they were building to Bernau was the chief head first of the Kremlin. The chief puts up on the 11th of October 1805, one of the infantry regiments of the Jesuits of Bernau had halted half a mile on the town awaiting the inspection of the Kremlin. The chief despite the un-Russian capital of the country and the arrival of the food from the stone walls of the mountains of the distance of foreign customs. Okay, stop, stop, time's up, that's 15 seconds. <laughs> Shots phenomenal. Congratulations, both of you. Okay, let's give our guys some time to tabulate it out. How fast, how fast do you think the fastest talker in the world, John Mishita, was just talking? 999 words. 999 words per minute. One more guess. How about you? I'd say about 400. 400 words per minute. Okay, up in the booth. How fast was John Mishita talking? According to our calculations in the booth, Michael, we're 500 words per minute. 500 words a minute. Okay, That's wait a second. Really now, cool. for the world's record, let's let them tabulate. Let's take a couple of guesses first. How fast do you think Fred Hirsch was reading? About 798. 798 words a minute. Anyone else want to guess? You want to guess? Uh, 3,000. 3,000 words a minute. Okay, three, that's pretty fast. Okay, for the world's record, up in the booth, we have a CPA with a lot of adding machines up there. How fast was Fred Hirsch just reading? Uh, Mike, according to our calculations, Fred read 18 pages at 500 words per pages. He read for 15 seconds, so we multiply that by four for one minute for an average of over 36,000 words per minute. 36,000! That's the world's record! The fastest reader read 25,000 words a minute. Congratulations, Fred Hirsch! And let's meet the fastest reader in the world. Congratulations. It's phenomenal. We just set a record right here on Amazing Discovery. Wait a second. We saw you flipping through the pages. Did you really remember what you've read? I mean, do you know what you've read? Well, of course. Otherwise, it wouldn't make any sense. Well, let me give you, let me give you a little test here. Now, I'm not a fast reader here, so just give me a chance here. I've got to think of a question. Just a second here. It's hard to talk while I'm reading. Okay, here we go. Uh, what was the name of a soldier, a Russian general, that was, that was fighting near a bridge? Well, it wasn't a Russian. It was a German soldier, and his name was Schmidt. And he was killed at the bridge <laughs> at 7 o'clock p.m. <laughs> Look at the same the last day. Fantastic! You did it! Congratulations, Fred. I mean, reading this fast, I mean, this has got to help you in your work. Oh, sure, but the primary reason for it is all those wonderful books out there, they, they enrich you. They, they, That's true. They take you places. They, they refresh your mind. They, they, and with a good book, you're never alone. Wow. Congratulations! The fastest reader in the world! We're going to submit, Fred, to the Guinness Book of World Records in England. Fantastic. John Mishita, what do you think of him? All thousands of words a minute. Well, I just want to say congratulations. I think you did a really terrific job. But, you know, I think I could have gotten a lot faster. All I needed was a bigger book. I mean, the words were a little small. I needed a bigger big book. I could have gotten much faster than I did. Okay. We'll give you another chance. <laughs> I, I think I'm finally catching up here. Now, John can only read so fast because he has to say every word. And Fred, well... He lets his mind do the work, and obviously he can read very fast. I mean, he broke the world's record. Well, you know, that's right, Mike. But also, comprehension increases when you use the program. Alphanetics can be used by anybody, Mike, a student or a teacher. Well, let's meet an educator, J.D. Mildrew. Now, you teach college. What subjects do you teach? Mike, I teach math and physics, the subjects that give the students the most trouble. But how does reading help you with, with math and physics? Many students come in math and physics. They're terrified by these subjects. They think it has something to do with their math aptitude. We find it has something to do with a reading ability. Really? So reading is the foundation for learning math and physics too, huh? If students develop a strong reading ability, then we find that their math and science performance increases. So alphanetics can help you in the field of sciences too? That's correct, Mike. Fantastic. Well, Tiffany, let's meet Tiffany, who is in high school, and Tiffany decided on her own to get involved with alphanetics and speed reading. Why was that? Well, the main reason that I decided to take the reading program was because I plan on going to college. And I've talked to some of my friends there in college, and they say that, that college is a lot of fun, but there's a lot of thick books that you have yes, to read. Yes, there are. <laughs> so I decided if I took the program and increased my reading, I'd be able to get through the books quicker and have more time for fun and still get good grades. 
pretty smart girl. Now, what was your beginning reading score? 230 words a minute. And where'd you end up with? 1,250 words a minute. Tw what an 1,250, what an improvement! And Mike, she was only on the program for a very short period of time. Incredible. Now, Tiffany, you brought your mom, Donna. Mom, what do you think of this? I'm really proud of Tiffany. She's always been a good student, Mike. But I think she feels better prepared now to go to college and tackle those big books. <laughs> I wish I'd had the program when I was in college. <laughs> Me too. Oh, and I'm really impressed, I gotta tell you. You know, Mike, reading is a key to all knowledge, and knowledge is a key to success. Now, alphanetics can work for anybody. It doesn't matter if you're a housewife, a business person, if your reading goals are to read technical materials, medical journals, the Bible, a cookbook, or just newspapers. Alphanetics can work for anybody. All right. <laughs> now, when we come back, we'll finally check in in our Amazing Discoveries classroom to see how our students are doing, and we'll get to talk with the fastest talker in the world again, John Mishita. Okay, Mike, just give me another chance. Another chance is all I want. Pretty please, pretty please, please. I'm begging you, please, Mike. Just another chance. That's all I really need. Would you do that for me, huh? And, and we're going to hear a very emotional story with a very happy ending thanks to Alphanetics. All this and more when we come back on Amazing Discovery! Does this look like your house? A pile of newspapers here, a stack of magazines here, and a mountain of books over there? You can't throw anything away. Someday you're going to get around to reading them, right? Or are you a student getting further and further behind in your homework because you just can't seem to stay on top of the reading assignments? Does keeping up with your job require you to read and read and then read some more? Read this for tomorrow morning's board meeting, Cromwell. So much to read that you have to take most of it home with you at night and still keep working and working and working? Well, you're not alone, but now you can join the thousands who read 5, 10, even 20 times faster thanks to the powerful alphanetic speed reading system. This program helped me to like read faster, so now I have time to read on myself, and I just like I think reading's fun now. When I first started out, I was a below average reader. Now I'm reading about 2,000 words a minute. But better than that, I went from a C to an A in English. Not bad, huh? Imagine reading your favorite magazine article in seconds, or the whole magazine cover to cover in just minutes. No more messy stacks of newspapers, and no more heaping piles of magazines cluttering your house. You've read them all thanks to Alphanetics. Think of how good you'll feel when you finish your homework and see your test scores shooting up with the help of your new reading ability from the Alphanetics system. And say goodbye to bringing home your job stress and unfinished work. Instead, say hello to your family and friends and start enjoying your time with them. You may even find you'll finally have some free time for yourself, too. Oh, well. No matter who you are or what you do, knowledge is the key to success, and reading is the single most important key to knowledge. The Alphanetic System shows you the secret to unleashing a power already within you that will take your mind out of the scrambled traffic jam of words and allow you to quickly read at lightning speeds, yet remember and enjoy what you've read. Now I can pick up a book and read it faster than I have been able to, and I never thought that I'd be able to read as fast as I am now. When you order the powerful Alphanetic Speed Reading System, here's what you'll get. Five power-packed audio cassettes that will show you the Alphanetic's way to turbocharge your reading ability. You'll see surprising results in just minutes. Next, the easy-to-follow Alphanetic's instruction manual that takes you step-by-step -step through the powerful system. You'll be amazed at just how easy it is to master the Alphanetic system. Thousands of people have paid as much as $200, $300, even $500 to learn speed reading the old-fashioned way. But as an amazing Discoveries viewer, you'll get the entire powerful new Alphanetic system for just $59.95. Start enjoying a lifetime filled with pleasure and knowledge through reading the Alphanetics way. Here's how to order. To order the complete Alphanetics system for only $59.95, have your credit card ready and call toll-free. 1-800-334-6600. Order now and you'll receive the five power-packed audio cassettes and the complete easy-to-follow step-by-step instruction manual. Call 1-800-334-6600 or send check or money order to Alphanetics, P.O. Box 4399, Albuquerque, New Mexico, 87196. Include $5.95 for shipping and handling. Start enjoying a lifetime filled with pleasure and knowledge through reading the Alphanetics way. Call 1-800-334-6600 now. to Amazing Discoveries. Now I want you to hear a very emotional story from a woman who had a very special reason why she got involved with alphanetics and speed reading. Louise Jacobson, tell us your story. I'm a mother of five and I found myself having to go back to work because of economic reasons. And I got a job as a secretary for a financial planner, only I didn't know anything about mutual funds and investing and insurance. But after doing the reading program, I was able to learn more about these and 
then I was able to do more things for my boss that, you know, he used to have to do. And your boss began to rely on you more? Yes, he did. That's but, you fantastic. know, the, the best thing is, though, that I enjoy reading and having to work full time and then having responsibilities at home. I didn't Five have... Five kids. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I didn't have a chance to do all the reading I wanted to do, but now I can. Fantastic. So it helps you with your career and with your life. And half home with... Now, you're in the real estate business. How, how can speed reading help you in, in real estate? Well, Mike, I've had an office for over 27 years. And speed reading has really been my edge over the competition. You know, there's thousands of offices out there and thousands of licensees. And there's a ream of material you have to go through to handle the client's needs and get it done properly. And speed reading has allowed me to do it properly and get it done right. Uh, it's probably the best tool in my office. In fact, uh, I'd say speed right? reading was the single most important factor to my success. So it's been your key to success. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Now let's meet Dr. Carl Mooney. Carl Mooney is with Texas A&M University. Yeah. Now, Dr. Mooney, I want to talk to you about reading at the college level. How can alphanetics help a college student? Well, the program of Alphanetics has built into it a time management component. And time management is something that really all college students need to get a good handle on. Otherwise, they're not going to find the success they need in their courses. But is this program only for better students? I mean, what about, you know, people who are... No, Mike, that's, that's one of the nice things about the Alphanetics program. The poor students or the slower student can gain that kind of confidence and also that success and speed that he or she needs to be competitive academically. So alphabetics can help poor students too. Now, Josh, we saw you in the remote piece, and you finished. What was your finish to, finishing words per minute? Three thousand six hundred words per minute, Mike. Wow, three thousand six hundred words a minute. But I understand you weren't always a fast reader, were you? What was your beginning score? One hundred eighty-one words per minute. One hundred eighty-one. Now, Owen, what does that mean? Mike, that's a little less than the average. So you went from less than average to 3,600 words a minute. You should be proud of yourself. I am proud of myself. Now, Josh brought his grandma. Lucille, grandma, you've got to be proud of Josh. Yes, I really am proud of Josh. And he shows a lot more confidence in himself, too. Well, what do you think of Alpha Do you think maybe you can get involved in it, too? I think it's great. And I have studied the tapes, and I'm going to continue and beat this guy. <laughs> Well, you got a good coach there. You gonna help Grandma? Yes, you am. <laughs> oh, and alphabetics has touched so many people's lives in so many different ways. Mike, I've seen it over and over again. Alphabetics can help anybody. <laughs> I see what you mean. All right, when we come back, we'll finally go over to our Amazing Discoveries classroom and see how our students are doing learning alphabetics. All this and more when we come back on Amazing Discoveries. Does this look like your house? A pile of newspapers here, a stack of magazines here, and a mountain of books over there? You can't throw anything away. Someday you're going to get around to reading them, right? Or are you a student getting further and further behind in your homework because you just can't seem to stay on top of the reading assignments? Does keeping up with your job require you to read and read and then read some more? Read this for tomorrow morning's board meeting, Cromwell. So much to read that you have to take most of it home with you at night and still keep working and working and working? Well, you're not alone, but now you can join the thousands who read 5, 10, even 20 times faster thanks to the powerful alphanetic speed reading system. This program helped me to, like, read faster, so now I have time to read on myself, and I just, like, I think reading's fun now. When I first started out, I was below average reader. Now I'm reading about 2,000 words a minute, but better than that, I went from a C to an A in English. Not bad, huh? Imagine reading your favorite magazine article in seconds, or the whole magazine cover to cover in just minutes. No more messy stacks of newspapers, and no more heaping piles of magazines cluttering your house. You've read them all thanks to Alphanetics. Think of how good you'll feel when you finish your homework and see your test scores shooting up with the help of your new reading ability from the Alphanetics system. And say goodbye to bringing home your job stress and unfinished work. Instead, say hello to your family and friends, and start enjoying your time with them. You may even find you'll finally have some free time for yourself, too. Oh, well. No matter who you are or what you do, knowledge is the key to success, and reading is the single most important key to knowledge. The Alphanetic System shows you the secret to unleashing a power already within you that will take your mind out of the scrambled traffic jam of words and allow you to quickly read at lightning speeds, yet remember and enjoy what you've read. Now I can pick up a book and read it faster than I have been able to, and I never thought that I'd be able to read as fast as I am now. 
When you order the powerful Alphanetics speed reading system, here's what you'll get. Five power-packed audio cassettes that will show you the Alphanetics way to turbocharge your reading ability. You'll see surprising results in just minutes. Next, the easy-to-follow Alphanetics instruction manual that takes you step-by-step -step through the powerful system. You'll be amazed at just how easy it is to master the Alphanetics system. Thousands of people have paid as much as $200, $300, even $500 to learn speed reading the old-fashioned way. But as an amazing Discoveries viewer, you'll get the entire powerful new Alphanetics system for just $59.95. Start enjoying a lifetime filled with pleasure your knowledge through reading the Alphanetics way. Here's how to order. To order the complete Alphanetics system for only $59.95, have your credit card ready and call toll-free. 1-800-334-6600. Order now and you'll receive the five power-packed audio cassettes and the complete easy-to-follow step-by-step instruction manual. Call 1-800-334-6600 or send check or money order to Alphanetics, P.O. Box 4399, Albuquerque, New Mexico, 87196. Include $5.95 for shipping and handling. Start enjoying a lifetime filled with pleasure and knowledge through reading the Alphanetics way. Call 1-800-334-6600 now. Back to Amazing Discoveries. Now we're finally going to get to check in with our audience members to see how they're doing with Alphanetics. But I found someone in our audience challenge that I want you to meet. Now you may not recognize this guy, but this is Gary Bradner. He's the author of The Howling. Welcome to Amazing Discoveries. I can't believe you're here. All right, now you, you took a pretest before Alphanetics, and your score was 380 words per minute with 60% comprehension. That's pretty good. And after Alphanetics, your score was 684 words a minute with 80% comprehension. What do you think, Gary? I learned a lot in a little time. I love it. All right. How about, how about Michael here? Michael, your pretest was 164 words a minute with 10% comprehension. And afterwards, can I have your after test here, Michael? 512 words a minute and 60% comprehension. What an improvement. What do you think, Michael? It's great. You did a good job. Hang in there. Time for one more. All right. Your name, please? Viola. Viola, let me take a look at your pretest. Your pretest was 294 words a minute and 55% comprehension. And after Alphanetics, 508 words a minute with 70% comprehension. Viola, what do you think? Oh, I'm happy. I'm so amazed. <laughs> Let me ask everyone here. Did you all remember what you read? Yeah. yeah. What do you think of Alphanetics? It's great. This is really something. Oh, and what can I say? I mean, I'm really impressed with your yeah, Alphanetics. I told you to be amazed, didn't I? I am, too. Uh, once you learn the secrets of Alphanetics, Mike, your reading is truly limitless. And you remember what you've read, too. I'm, this is very good. I think we all have to agree. Alphanetics is truly an amazing discovery. Until next time, I'm Mike Levy, and this is Amazing Discovery. The staff of Amazing Discoveries would love to hear from you. Just drop us a line at Amazing Discoveries, P.O. Box 470, Hollywood, California, 90078. All right, John, you ready for a little friendly competition? I'm ready if you are. Okay, on your market set, go. In, in the October, October of 19... The Russian, the Russian troops, troops were occupying the towns and villages, and the French... And 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 all right, all right, you're all right, you won, you won. Well, you could do two. I mean, you, know, you did pretty good, you just have to talk a little bit faster. Practice is the key.